1-800-926-1111. Breaking news right now on KCAL 9 News at noon. Welcome back to KCAL 9 News. We are following breaking news for you this afternoon. Sky 9 was just in Hollywood where there was an officer involved shooting. This happened right on Hollywood Boulevard just east of Highland about an hour ago. Police tell us one person was hit by a bullet and a second person was grazed. We're told that no officers were hurt. We will have the latest on this developing story on KCAL 9 News at 4. Sky 9 is also live in Sawtell, where the LA Fire Department is on the scene right now after getting reports of two people suffering from electric shock related injuries. This is on Olympic and Bundy in the West LA area. Crews also just put out a small fire that was burning on the roof of a building under construction. I want to go ahead and take a live look outside right now and checking in with meteorologist Alex Biston. Santa Monica looking pretty nice yeah, out there, Alex. It is. It is for a Thursday afternoon. Not bad, right? Uh, you know, we will start to see the low clouds and fog bank back up, especially along the coast as we head uh, later into tonight and into the overnight hours. But let's talk about our sunrise and sunset. We saw sunrise this morning right at around 553. Sunset, if you're hoping to catch it this evening, is at 804 officially. Let's time out your day. Here's exactly what you can expect for the rest of the day for the metro area. So we're going to be topping out mostly in the 80s. We'll feel upper 70s as we head into the 5 o'clock hour. 74 degrees by 7 p.m. Maybe taking an evening walk, taking the dog out. It's going to be really nice. We've got uh, winds coming out of the southwest. Pretty calm as we head into later this evening. So if you are headed up into the mountains for the next few days, we do have a slight chance of thunderstorms, especially today. Drier air tomorrow. Monsoonal moisture makes a return as we head into Saturday, so we would we'll keep that chance of thunderstorms in the forecast for you, and that's actually going to continue through much of next week, so we will break down the seven day forecast very soon. For now, Serene, back to you. All right, Alex, thank you. Our dangerously dry and hot summer weather is prompting the Angeles National Forest to bump up the fire threat level to extreme. That means more restrictions if you visit. KCAL 9's Nicole Comstock has the story from Azusa. Looking out into the canyon full of dry.